Good morning. It is Friday, July 3rd, the Feast of St. Thomas. Yes, the feast of the person that is probably the patron of every person in the world because, of course, he's good old Doubting Thomas. You know, no matter how much we try to follow the Lord, no matter how faithful we say we are, there are still times that we doubt. And the wonderful thing about the story of Thomas is that we learn an amazing fact. Jesus loves us nonetheless. Thomas said, I will not believe, not unless I can put my fingers in his hands and my hands in his side. And we hear that the next time Jesus appeared, Jesus just looked at Thomas and said, go for it. Thomas exclaimed, my Lord and my God. And Jesus said, blessed are those who have not seen, but believe. And that would be you and I. I don't think any of us have seen the Lord personally. We have seen and experienced his great works many times in our lives. We have experienced what he has done for others, but we have not had a chance to see the Lord personally. And yet Jesus calls us to a deeper faith and trust each day. Some days we're all in. Some days we're like Thomas and say, I'm not going to believe, not unless. And we start to put conditions to the Lord. Lord, I won't believe unless my loved one gets well. I won't believe unless I can pass my test. I won't believe unless I get a promotion. It's not the way to do it. He calls us to trust in him. And he lets us know that he will always be there for us. Whether we believe or not is entirely up to us. But that's not going to change how much God loves us. He loves us completely. And for this, we give great thanks today. God bless you this day and every day of your lives.